goes the Chief. Taking down the other one. Brilliant play there. Gets taken down from the Cat. Double till, double kill, excuse me. Farrah ult coming in. The Bonsai managing to kill the Farrah Cat before she can do much more damage. Let's switch over to Bonsai. He goes in. He's trying to wreck that back line. Is he going to take out the Orisa? No, he doesn't. He fades away. He's got his ult. That is going to be useful here with 91% taken. You're going to probably see him go in and use his ult. He gets one, he gets two, he gets three. Bonsai taking out four. Quote, finishing it up. 10 player kill streak from Bonsai, and that is the first map secured for Murray State Racers. Quote, doing what Lucio does best, harassing, putting Murray State into overtime. That's what you need. Holding on until his team can provide reinforcements. He's got the sound boost, so he has a little more survivability. He's going to. Just stay on those walls, getting away. Now he can back off because his team is here, and here comes Murray State. Can they do the second shutout in a row and win map one? The pick on Finn. Here comes Murray State. Two picks. It's going to be three. They get Cat. They get the Orisa. Mercy's down. Murray State ticking away the overtime, and it looks like they're going to win this with a team kill. Murray State Racers take the map. Coming around the left-hand side of the statue, you got Widow up top, popping in shots. Right-hand side shields coming in from Marissa. Murray State needs to be careful here. That's one pick, Widow down. Don't need to worry about those long-range DPS as the shields come down and prevent the rest of Fort Hayes from gaining a foothold. Murray State with Bonsai, and quote, cleaning up. And Fort Hayes has to retreat. Murray State, this is the kind of thing that would not affect them. Um, they've got good composure. We have three seconds. We will find out if Murray State can push on and make this a clean two to nothing. Aziz, bringing down the shield, inching forward. Interesting switch from Fort Hayes. They switched over to the Reinhardt. They've got the Sigma as well. And McCree and Farah again. Cat. She's definitely got consistency on that cat. Murray State making quick work of Fort Hayes. Could that be it? Moira on the point trying to survive. The Chief with a double, and that's it. We come back from a pause. Murray State, quick victory. Excellent gameplay. Excellent teamwork. Way to go, Murray State. Murray State on their day is one to nothing now. Let's see what this play of the game is. Flavville with the heals, with the kills, with the ults. Already with all doesn't get a kill on anybody. They need to focus here. Brilliant ice wall from in her once again. Can they get advantage? Yes, Aziz takes out the Arissa Tico. Connor, their Sigma going down as well. And just like that, Boston tries to be aggressive to punish Murray State. Murray State manages to turn the tides. They're going to move forward here. Bonsai taking out the Moira and set up now their defense. And you've got to expect they're going to get about uh, identical uh, camera angles. They're gonna go through this main choke point. Bonsai continuously checking his flanks. And her brilliant, brilliant play to heal himself right there in the ice block. He freezes the Doomfist. That's two DPS, DPS down for Boston University. Connor gets to pick on Aziz. Pushing forward, here comes Murray State. They wanna capitalize on this. Trying to take down Orissa. Orissa retreats into the center cover. And her gonna try and put an ice wall to block off Boston University in the red. Trying to freeze the Moira. Bonsai as well, with Anher, just trying to harass Boston and keep the percentages fairly even. 76 versus 75. This game is even so far, and what a game it is. Lucio, quote, coming in from Murray State, trying to take down the Moira, trying to clean it up, and it is chaos on the point right now. And her in chief getting two points. This might be might be where Murray State can take and regain some points. 93% for Boston University. Boston has switched over to the Hammond. They're going to freeze him. It's a big risk, big risk to switch to the Wrecking Ball. They have a Blizzard. Pay attention to this guy right here, Ander. His May was crucial the last time they played King's Row against Davenport. Can he come up big for his team? Ice Wall coming in, separating the Reinhardt, although Reinhardt's bubbled. Got to wait for the comp to reveal itself, but it looks like they're running Reinhardt Zarya. Shields coming in to protect their May. They are running Reinhardt. Wow, interesting lineup here. Reinhardt, Zarya, Widowmaker, Genji, Anna, and Lucio. Interesting. Reaper flanking around the back lines. He gets slept by the Ana. What a shot. He's going to have to back up. He did have his fade. Doesn't even need to use it there. He's just going to do the damage. Poke cleans up the kill. 
And Aziz and Chi picking them up, and Murray State making quick work on the first point. They're gonna take it. Chief is just gonna do his duty, putting down the shield to protect his teammates. He's getting charged by the Lucio. Lucio trying to boot him uh, or push him back towards the other team, but it doesn't work. Chief's staying alive. EZV does get the kill on him, but EZV goes down to Anher as well. Flatfield putting in the heels. A Sigma charges him. He manages to go down, but Murray State holding on. This is chaotic once again. Both teams playing very well. Murray State coordination just top notch right now. Thanks, excellent, excellent work on that. You don't see that online. Lucio Frozen reloads at an inopportune time, but it doesn't matter. He's able to get the Doomfist, and her is able to get a kill, and Aziz as well. Actually, and her with the double. Well done, and Flop Filth even picking up a kill. Moira with the Coalescence, May with the Blizzard, Rubidic Flux and Doomfist just slightly mistiming, but Quote has his Coalescence. He's going to try and keep everybody alive and do some damage to Doomfist. Doomfist wants to punish the Moira. He manages to back him up, and Quote! Amazing kill on the Doomfist. Way to stay calm in those positions. Lucio is frozen. Is he going to go down as well? Flatfield falls. And it is a hotly contested point at the moment. Heels coming in. They need to keep Aziz alive. The Chief just throwing his boulders, doing what he can, keeping the shields to protect his teammates. Pushing forward here, leading the line. Murray State needs to watch out for that Doomfist in the back. They do. Had the crucial timing on those immortality. Very good at it. And now here comes the Gravitic Flux from Northwood. Can that take anybody out? Three picks coming in from Murray State. Bonsai again with the double kill and the triple. Almost a team wipe. Chief gets the kill on their Reaper. Red team, Northwood, back against the wall. 76% 70, is a team kill. Now we do see, if we do a quick ult check, you can see uh, matching number of ults, but I do believe Murray State has the better combination. Doomfist bringing his ult. Coalescence going online. Murray State, are they going to pop any here? Doomfist coming in, both Doomfist. Random Rager getting a double kill with his ult. Bonsai manages to clean up the other dunes. Doomfist gets another kill. Murray State, double kill coming in from Anher from his ult. And overtime is over. Murray State takes the first map. I and hold them off, forcing them through that one spot. And here comes the Junkrat. Oh, can he get anybody? He gets one, Fushi. You don't want the tank to go down here. This is a time where you need the barriers. Northwood pushing ahead. Can they capitalize on the pick? Murray State still alive. Coalescence coming out. Are they going to pop any more ults here? They do have the advantage. Damage Matrix coming in from Flatfield. Blizzard going out as well. It's going to be an ult fight. Immortality Field. Now it's gone. It's not going to provide any benefit. Flatfield cleaning up. Not only doing the heals, but doing the damage and Bonsai as well. And just like that, Murray State turns a bad situation into a good one. Excellent play. Doomfist coming in. And as soon as you think it's over, they come back. Reaper trying to get the kills. And there's the ult from Bonsai. He gets the kill. He gets three. Is Murray State going to hold it? Overtime almost done. And Murray State takes round one. His shield down to protect his team. Murray State moving up quickly. Bob's going to do something. He's in the point. Bonsai bringing in his ult on top of the Bob as well. Just gonna bring in the damage and her gets to pick up Diva the Diva. They're down one tank. Murray State moving forward, pushing Florida State out of the point. They want to clean up as well. Die goes down, door goes down, and so does Maxwell. Murray State now gonna take the point back, and so far pretty evenly matched, 37 to 40 percent. Murray State now will take the lead. Now Lee Jung Tower. This is Night Market. Symmetra strat that we saw yesterday. Oh, both teams are gonna run that today. Wow. Interesting. Both windows claimed by both teams. Murray State gets there a little bit ahead of time, and they're pushing Florida State back. Quite the symmetrical play there. <laughs> there yeah, definitely was a bit of symmetry there. <laughs> Hashtag dab jokes. Bolts, same for Florida, but not for long because they're popping him early. Coalescence coming in along with the Valkyrie. Reaper going to try and flank around on the left, but beautiful wall from Symmetra, and they're just dancing around the barrier to stay alive. Maria bubbling herself to stay alive, but it's really not going to matter with the Reinhardt Maxwell and the Reaper going down, and there's Sloth falling as well. Murray State letting overtime 
Trickle away. And it looks like they're going to take this one as well. And that's map one to Murray State. Map one to Murray State. GG. From Florida State, but Bonsai looks ready. I think he's read this perfectly. Beautiful ice wall coming in. The Reaper is all alone. He's just going to wow. sit up there with the shield. Perfect ice wall. And now that May is in trouble for Florida State. Maxwell is going to have to back off. And the kills just come too easily for Murray State. Double shield is in meta, so maybe they're trying something new here. But that ice wall was once again perfect. Got Murray State being picked off There's there. The Blizzard. Blizzard coming in. 3 4 frozen. Die, die, die. Bonsai cleaning up. Bonsai in her with the team kill on Florida State. You reckon that was a Snickers or maybe a Reese's Pieces Blizzard? <laughs> uh, it was a team kill the, Blizzard. The one with a lot of dead people. The one with a lot of dead people. Uh, Already around the bin. Coalescence from Florida State is going to be running out momentarily. There's Blizzard the coming State. up from Murray State. One, two, maybe three. That that may protected herself. Is she going to pop out and get frozen? No, she doesn't. She backs off. Flotfield getting two. He can get the kills as well as healing. Murray State able to clean up, and now they can stabilize. 56 seconds left. Excellently played for Murray State. Beautiful Blizzard. And you see the box, the glowing yellow box. Murray State trying to get there. That'll and move the chains. Wow, they've got three on the point. Florida's going to have to rush forward here. They switch over to Lucio and a Doomfist to try and boost there quickly. And Doors on the Reaper, but they're not going to get there in time. They're going to touch it and delay it momentarily. Coalescence coming in as well. Murray State sleeping. The Doomfist. Big sleep from Flavfield coming in. And that's three down for Florida State. Murray State is going to push forward here and win this. They just need to get to Lucio. And Murray State, the Reaper doesn't get there in time. Oh. Excellent work from Murray State. That's a 2-0. That's a 2-0. GG. Thank you very much, uh, Florida State. Thank you very much, Murray State. Let's see what Bonsai is going to accomplish with this play of the game. Yeah. Yeah. Not a sex tuple, but we'll take it. We'll take it. <laughs>
Murray State holding firm. We've seen some excellent defensive work from Murray State so far. Here comes the blizzard from Murray State. And Hearn hanging on by a thread thanks to the immortality field. They've got several frozen ice wall separating them. Is anybody going to fall? Actually, Villanova coming away slightly better there, but Murray State able to trade out as well. And once again, Murray State holding on to the point. To uh, a fight they don't want. You got to watch this top window. Ice wall preventing the high shots coming in, but they've still got eyes on underneath. Real damage between those coalescence coming in for Villanova. They're pushing it forward. Now there's the Farah. Ice wall coming in from Maiden. The uh, Murray State Racers are shooting them as they inch forward. Preventing flux, but in Excellent kill from Bonsai with his ultimate and an excellent immortality kill from Cloudville to keep this team alive. Under 30 seconds remaining. Can Murray State hold it here? There's they Halo the down. there. That is going to be crucial. They need Moira fades away, but not far enough. She can fall here and she does. Murray State might be able to hold this. 20 seconds remaining. 3 to 1. This might push it to a map 3. Murray State Racers killing the May. That's oh, going to be critical as well. Really critical. When you stagger these DPSers, it really hurts your team to push them. Murray State with the early blizzard there. They read the play, they got the kills, and that's going to do it for Mer Villanova unless they can get there quick enough. Halo once again dying on the shield. I didn't get to see it based on where we were looking, but Zoom, that was the chief, and Murray State clinical for Farrah. Lots of open room to fire out, but they can take it down. And her, once again, those ice picks. Not only does he have the walls, but he has the picks. Not only with the kills, but the ice picks as well. Bonsai now going to win. And this is early aggression from Murray State staying on that point. They, they've let Villanova move forward here. And now they're just going to hold on to this point underneath that bridge. And oh. what a flank from Bonsai to take out the Mercy. Murray State. So far, immortality feels are difficult. Bonsai with a double. We stay alive. The healers keep him alive. They're pushing forward. And her has switched over to the Widowmaker. We may go first person on him in a little bit if he stays because this some wow plays coming in right now. Ooh. There's some damage going Ooh. in. Let's go, Murray State. Pushing around. Nova may just go ahead and give this up. They're probably going to do some damage here just to build some ult. But no, actually, they're going to commit. Decided to commit. Immortality Field from Flatfield is going to protect from the Junkrat ult. It does. Box time does kill the Immortality Field, but nobody else. Bonsai getting the kill. And her as well. Bonsai with the double. And her with the double as well. That's going to be. It's not a team kill. One away, it looks like. One or two away. Two away. I'm really amazed at how well they were able to keep Bastion alive at that point. He was really low. He's about halfway on health almost. And now she's low to the first and keeping her alive. Villanova pushing forward here. This is just what we saw last time. Murray State staggered now, and they need to stabilize. There's a blizzard uh, coming in. How many are they going to get? Oh my goodness. It's, it's just kills after kills after kills here. I can't believe what I'm seeing. Really, no one survived I that. I can't believe what I'm seeing here. <laughs> this is an insane Overwatch match. You know, you, you say you want to watch the pros play, but you know what's going to happen. And sometimes you get a really nice good pros match. Sometimes you just get a stomp. The Vancouver Titans early in this season before Rollock, you know, just more wiping the floor of everybody. But in the collegiate scene, you get this. You don't know what you're going to get. Villanova going for the aggressive surprise hold on the left, but it's not going to pay off. Look at that Bastion Bonsai just ticking away the time as the rest of the racers clean them up. Brilliantly played by Murray State, and Villanova caught by their own trap. That was the most clutch ice wall I've ever seen in this game. They knew. They had to have known. They had to say, no, they're going to set up in there. They're going to... They may have heard them. They may have heard you them. You can hear them through the wall. You can... Get your spamming voice line. Bonsai cleaning up is the Bastion again. He's been huge today. Not in a great Chief position right now, but well. he keeps getting saved by his team, and that's just more stagger uh, to help Murray State move this payload a little bit faster. We're going to need at least one of these players to play really badly in the next couple minutes because I can't talk about everybody at once. Everybody's been playing so well, especially this map. We're taking out the Sigma as well. Look at that yellow box, he's in sight. Murray State almost on their oh. way to the victory. Perfect ice wall. Bastion the first one. Oh, Here comes Murray gosh. State, they're pushing forward. Are the racers going to take it? And Murray State is going to win. Murray State! Let's go. Holy cow, let's go. GG. Let's go, racers.